Oh, man. All I can say, y'all, Wix code, y'all. <laughs> Wix code, y'all. I'm joined here by Yuval. Look, how long have we been waiting to say those two words? Yeah. Let's say it together once. Wix, Wix code, code y'all. Y'all. No, so I'm here. I wasn't. I wasn't familiar with the nomenclature. You have to say y'all. This is this is the Wix community. Okay, guys. I'm here with a lot of experts. I hope you have your glasses ready because this is a day for all experts. You guys should be so excited. Big group toast right here. Raise your glass. I'm spinning the camera around. Come together. Come together. Make sure you're in the shot. Toast Wix code, y'all. <laughs> All right, so so we're going to start this off. I have Yuval here. Guys, this is unprecedented. What we're talking about doing here and the things that, that we've announced today, fundamentally, it changes the landscape. We are now in another ball game. This is the expert's world. Okay, so this has to be just as exciting for you, too. So I, I want you to, you've been working on this for a long time. What? How do you feel now that we've there's this tool that exists for the experts that they can build anything with? I've been sitting on this for a heck of a lot of time, and I think one of the one of the uh, biggest points that um, that I remember is is way back like almost a year ago. I think you 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 sent an, a message to the community asking them like if you could choose any feature on Wix, like what would you create? And I think there was there was someone on that um, on that thread who said. I wonder what the little elves are thinking. <laughs> and I was looking at that and I said, oh my God, I could only tell them what we were working on. We've been, uh, it is like, it's like that thing that they tell you, they say, uh, uh, Brett, you can't say this word, you can't say this word, you can't say this word. So the first thing I want to say is, you know, don't say the color blue. You cannot say the color blue when you walk into the room. Well, y'all, I just, blue, and oh my gosh. It's like that with code. We have, this is, this is the day. This is the day. So, so you guys have been, the little elves have been cooking. Mm hmm what are some of the what are some of the best things you've seen with code? So we've seen some really amazing things um, from the from the community that's been that's been uh, exposed really early to the to the product and uh, the alpha community, which have offered also a lot of great um, great input into the into the creation of the system. Deserve a round of applause. Oh man! Um, so we've seen some amazing things, and I don't want to I don't want to uh, preempt any any of the uh, conversations going to happen here. Um, but a lot, a lot of the things uh, we've been seeing is the, the things that are most uh, emotional for me are seeing people who are empowered to create things that they couldn't create uh, previously. That's right. you know, people who have uh, built themselves up from scratch uh, become web designers because uh, they found it uh, they found it easy to create with Wix, and are now we're giving them more tools and we're allowing them to create you know significantly different uh, solutions than they could have before. So that's that's really what's most exciting. In terms of what we've seen, so I'm not going to go into what the alpha community have done. We got a bunch of people who are going to talk about that, and that's coming um, up. We have some we have some experts here that are just chomping the bit to tell y'all what they've done. But so, uh, just as an example, back in when was this? I think I think it was uh, December or January. We set aside 600 Wix employees uh, for a hackathon, and we gave them three days to create whatever they wanted. And uh, we had 110 teams submit real world solutions that they had done. And to see the things that they had created in three days was amazing. Um, and I think probably the, the, the two that most stand out, uh, the first one was with almost no code at all, was a, a real estate site. So they had cloned, you know, uh, probably most of the real estate uh, type of sites that, that you know, on the, on the web. They created a full-blown real estate solution where I could, I could uh, upload uh, a listing, I could view the listings, I could see them on a map. And I could filter them and and select the right one for me. And it was, of course, at Wix we have some amazing designers at work. And that and one deserves a toast. That gets that, that is a question that gets asked every single every single week. Is is MLS? Has anybody done MLS? How do we tap in? How do we do real estate? And so so that's that's that gets asked every week. And and this is a way just with code right. that you're talking about for real estate. Well, with code but without code, right? And so without or without it's, code, it's with Wix code but without any JavaScript. Beautiful. Um, so that's that's really amazing to see. Seeing you know as as part of the creation of, of this of this tool, we've tried to make it accessible to all the different uh, skill sets out there. We've tried to make you know JavaScript. Obviously, I was talking a lot about JavaScript developers. We've made it much uh, simpler for them to create sites. 
but we've also tried to empower uh, the designer community and, and really any type of, of user out there to create much more than they could have before. And a little secret, we're going to keep working in that direction. <laughs> um, nice. So, so what we're doing is we're, we're, we're allowing people to create the types of site that they couldn't do before, that they had to go out and hire developers, or they had, they had to go and, and, and go out to other platforms to do. Um, and and so, so kind of that magic of, of, of pairing the, the visual richness and the ease of use of the editor with all that power of code, but also uh, providing a lot of features where I don't need JavaScript to do. Um, that's been really amazing to see. That's the non-coding side. Um, let's go back to that hackathon. One of the other amazing things we saw was was a team that created a, a quiz site. So you know, there's lots of uh, of uh, online solutions where I can I can create a quiz and I can I can share it. So so um, they created this kind of quiz site where I'd see an image and I'd have four kind of, four questions and I'd have to answer it. And, you know, I'd go through a few quizzes and then it, it, it there was like a leaderboard kind of thing. Um, it was really interactive and fun, and they took it even one step further, and they they let the visitors create their own quiz. Wow! And share that share that with their users. So that wow. was like a really fun kind of uh, kind of solution that we saw being built in three days um, over Wix code. That's 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 incredibly amazing, and it's it's so exciting to 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 see sort of. Uh, the limitations just g massively expanding of, as to what you can do, but but I I, I, I from a, from 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 our community there's so many amazing creatives and designers and, and and one of the things that is so appealing to the Wix platform is the fact that it's it's truly a drag and drop editor where where someone that has fundamental design knowledge can just make something stunning and simple it's so quickly. Mm -hmm. A lot of people are not maybe very good at coding what what do you say to those that that out, that are out there that that may not have much coding knowledge and 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 I know we talked about earlier in the presentation how it makes it easy can you expound just a little bit on that so let me start off by saying that I'm not very good at coding either yeah there's a reason I stopped being a developer 10 years ago <laughs> and that's probably it um, but but really as I said we're trying to empower all these different uh, all these different types of users and all these all this you know the skill sets are a continuum we tried to build the system in a way where um, these awesome tools are available to you and you can go really deep, but you don't have to. Right. Right. And uh, we have a guy who used to be on the team who said, um, uh, you know, like Wix has always been about that democratization. And he said that um, that not uh, not having to code was a blessing, but not being able to code was a curse. Yeah. Right. So so we're, we're letting you uh, we're letting you delve really deep into that. But we're also. Uh, building the system in a way that reveals itself based on your skill set and based on how deep you want to go. So I can do I can do a heck of a lot without actually writing any code. And and the further I go, you know, the more the more power is exposed to me. Of course, I know I know everybody up there. There's a there's a huge, massive amount of people that are just dying to shake your hand, say hello, speak to you. So I, I don't want to keep you for too long, but. Uh, um, I, I can't thank you enough. Can and I and I know I know the experts are going to want this. Is it is it possible for us to do a roundtable in the future and just kind of sit down and and sort of maybe do a, a recap and and maybe some pointers or something fun like that for the community? Sure. Well, the whole point of this beta, right, is to to engage with our first users as much as possible. So we're we're as I said, we've been in stealth for for years. Yes. And and we are hungry for that. Kind Wix of input. code, y'all. We're hungry for that kind of input. So like any opportunity to speak with the community is. It's That's blessing. fantastic. Everybody, this is you all y'all This is huge. This is huge, huge. By the way, by the way, any questions you guys drop them. I can't we've got people watching. I'm going to I'm going to try to answer as many as I can. Next up in the hot seat, I'm bringing Anthony Walker over here. Come on out. Yeah, I'm picking you first, brother. Let's go. Okay. Anthony. Yes. Anthony came to Miami not long ago and uh, <laughs> Have some stories. <laughs> we'll leave it there. We'll leave it there. You, 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 you've been using this for a while. You've yep. you've been developing some amazing sites. Yep. Everybody's seen your stuff. You have some amazing stuff. Yep. But you're working on something new. Yep. So I want to know what we we want to know about it. Okay, so I'm doing a security guard network that connects security employees with companies. You know, seeking them for their contracts. Um, so I was at a point where I had to use, you know, like a one, two, three contact form. Um, and basically kind of like use list build and manually upload, you know, all these types of, uh, you know, applicants. And that was being really time consuming for me. And I actually put the project at a halt. Um, but when I came into Wix code, 
you know, I actually was able to automate the whole process, you know, from basically creating a custom form to actually sorting them all into a database that was sorted by location. So it's actually... I see that every week. Yeah. We see that every week. We <laughs> talk about forms, and, the, and now that we have the ability to customize our own forms and maintain our own database, how excited does that make you? That's amazing. I mean, I have a, a ton of clients that could benefit from something like that. You know, a lot of people do manual things. Mm -hmm. and I think any person who has something that is really like, a manual process can benefit from automating their process using code. So and it doesn't have to involve any type of coding at all. You know, it's just going in there, using the tools, watching the tutorials, and it's really simple to use. How hard was it for you to just jump in and do it? Uh, it was done in about two hours. Wow. Two hours. Did you hours. have any coding experience before that? No, still don't. <laughs> wow. Well, no, you can't say that now because now you've got some amazing stuff yep, on the horizon. Yep, yep, absolutely. So, I mean, it's amazing. I mean, I even got an investor to fund the, the, the concept as well. You this know, guy. And I can this actually guy. say, look, now we could do this. It's not something that we have to kind of like babysit, you know, using a manual method. Yeah. So it's, it's amazing. It's really taking the business to another level that it couldn't reach on its own. It's going to expand yeah. your possible clientele reach as well. Yep. Because the, the I, 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 if, if what Abishai said is right, yep. there's going to be a rush to this. 100%. And that's y'all. That's you. The, this It's our community. It's, it's, it's. It's a landscape changer. Yeah, it's something you shouldn't be afraid of. Because, I mean, it's only going to, you know, better your business, you know, make everything you do a lot simpler. Matt, do we have any questions from, from say, you two? Just, no. just, yeah, so call the them out. The first question is how can or when we see this in action get to play? Oh, okay, okay. We all want to play. I've got that <laughs> coming. That's, don't, yeah, that's a good question. That one's for a secret surprise visitor that's waiting for us. And from a Lynn, <laughs> yeah. they want to ask, how can you talk about performance, please, and we get a chance to talk about load times and websites and waste code? Okay, that's actually a really good question. Uh, the infrastructure that's being, I do know the infrastructure that's being built behind this environment, um, it's going to be a little different, so the speeds are, are, are you're probably going to see a speed boost. Uh, so, uh, it's good. It could be at least the same. You, you, it, it's at least <laughs> the same, but, but it's, 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 everything we're doing is incrementally getting better, so yep. that's what we're working on. Sissy wants to know if this will replace Wix blogs or stores. No, it's not replacing Wix blog or stores, but those things obviously can be fundamentally increased and enhanced with this. You can do more that you couldn't do with those products. Let's, Anthony. I'm gonna let's get another expert in All here. Right, got it. I'm gonna call Karen. You ready? All right. Karen's got her glass ready. Come on, we're having <laughs> a, we're having a hot seat. We're having fun tonight. And it's hot in here. Cheers. 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 Brett. So, <laughs> Karen. <laughs> How long have we waited for this? A long time. This is amazing. This is amazing. So, so everybody knows you. You're a part of the community. Again, you and Anthony both amazing designs. What could you not do before that now you have executed? Yeah. So basically, I'm working, or I've been working with a client. Um, their name is Brunch Boys. Go look them up. It is basically food wonders of the world. Um, he's a famous Instagrammer, and what we've been doing, or what we've been trying to do, is add all of these restaurant pages. So he basically goes to restaurants all across New York City, um, you know, takes pictures of food and puts uh, information on his website. Now the problem is with so many restaurants, when you visit hundreds of restaurants, you have to create a single page for every one of those restaurants, and they all need to look the same. You know, they all need to resemble their. It's a template. Um, our issue was when we started to make these uh, pages, you know, at one point uh, he was like, hey, can we add this uh, section to this restaurant page? And I was just like, I was fearing that day and I was like, no, we can't do that because that means I have to go into every single one of those hundred pages yes, yes, and yes. change that. So with Wix code, I am going to be able to basically put all of the information that exists on every single one of those restaurant pages in one database, which means that it's amazing. going forward, I mean, thing is we have a hundred restaurants right now he's thinking of like you know expanding I mean I think he has restaurants all across the world so you know when we hit a thousand restaurants it's not gonna be like hey let's change this button color and go yes. to a thousand pages and do that for a thousand pages so I'm super pumped um, we've been building it out and it's honestly I'm not a coder I'm a designer and I was surprised how easy it is so so, so you jumped right in and now now you're what I'm what I'm hearing is your scalability has, for, for those sort of much higher level sites, has expanded oh, dramatically. Oh yeah, absolutely. And what's cool about it is that if I 
so choose, I can actually have him maintain and update his own restaurants where before he had, I mean, we might still do it, but he had to have us do it. You know, it was, it was a larger process or maybe I can have someone who is under me. Just it's literally as easy as updating an Excel uh, spreadsheet, which is amazing. That's, that's really amazing. And I'm, I'm super excited to hear predominantly the things that I know we've said that we can't do or the frustrations. You know, you've all mentioned that post that I made so long ago about what's the one thing you wish you could do on Wix. Mm -hmm. And 95% of the responses, you know, we were just sitting there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We got that. And I'm hearing this. I'm hearing this and, and what you're doing with it and, and is, is going to blow our minds. We're more excited to see what this community does with this, starting with that and starting with what Anthony's doing and everyone else. We're so excited to see that. It's it's amazing. I'm excited. Oh, I'm, I'm excited for you. Cheers, cheers. cheers. I hope everybody has drinks out there because <laughs> it's crazy here. Okay, thank right. you. Thank you so Easy. much, Karen. I'm now going to invite to the stage Miss Lorraine Lilly. Oh, she's bringing her, oh, we gotta do another toast, y'all. Yeah. We're getting our poor audience completely cheers, inebriated. Old. Cheers. <laughs> So, so, same question. You've you, you've you've begun working on things, uh -huh. and, and 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 there's points in time where you can't finish it because there's something else you needed, and you've worked on something. What have you done that you feel like code sort of? So a little bit like Karen, um, I set up a database. I'm working on a, a website that talks about it's a resource for families moving to New York. And we wanted to create a neighborhood um, where you can click on a button and it will bring up the information on the neighborhood. So I created a database with information about the different neighborhoods. And now they are uh, made a dynamic page that you click on a picture of a neighborhood and it brings up all the information. And it takes wow. a little time to, to create the website, uh, to create the database to begin with. But then it just populates all the information and you don't have to keep kind of updating all the time. So that was great. Um, I've also, uh, I'm adding a new form to my own website um, that will be a, a client interest form and it has conditional um, fields. So that on the input field, there's a, a drop down. If they click a certain item, it produces one result. Um, on the form, if it you choose another uh, drop down, it creates another result on the form. So, and then that will feed into my database. And I think for businesses, being able to have really customized forms right there that they can build that feeds into a database that then they can use to analyze for their business um, is really cool. How many clients do you have right now that need this upgrade? Well, I think, you know, with every business, you are looking at what you can do with the platform. Um, I met with a client today who is a school, and so when we had that presentation upstairs uh, about the, the school admissions, I immediately, one of the things I thought, oh gosh, I can use this yes. um, with this school. They can uh, set up an admissions database um, where people can upload their form and um, have the information. They're not having to recreate it in Excel. So that's really, that's great. Is this exciting for you now that you've 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 got a, a whole new set of tools that you can do anything? Yeah, I mean, it definitely. Um, there's a little bit of learning curve in the beginning, um, so there were some tutorials, video tutorials that I watched, and some uh, resources that I read. And um, you know, as I was watching the videos, I was trying things out to see how they worked. And so, once you start playing um, with the code, it it's great. Um, you know, the, there are some resources uh, for some of the APIs that you, once you start using them, you can use them over and over again. So I think as more APIs are put um, as a resource, people will become comfortable with using them. I think that's a, I think that's going to be a huge fundamental, something that we do as a community is build those and share them, right? Yeah, so that would be great. Yeah. And, and maybe there's a, a forum that someone says, hey, I did X, Y, and Z. This is the... API code I used. Exactly. Someone will go, oh yeah, I need that. You know, so something like that would be uh, would exactly. Be great. But I'm I, sure Wix is going to think of that. So. Of course, of course. Well, we have we have a community, and this is yeah. exactly what we do. Thank you so much, Miss Lorraine. Welcome. I'm so good. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. All right. Now we've got one more expert, uh, and then we've got we're going to talk a little bit about what's going on with uh, the beta and and kind of how this kind of came to be. So.
Before we get there, I'm going to invite the last expert to come sit down with us. David, will you come join us? Yep. Y'all know David Farmer. Cheers, David. Cheers. Cheers. Like <laughs> I'm a chugger. A chugger. <laughs> David Farmer, it. everybody. So, so David, you're excited about this. You've had a sneak peek. You've, you're aware of what it can do. And not only are you aware of what it can do, you have some interesting plans. What are your plans? Yeah, so our, our situation is a little bit different in that uh, – ModSock at our company, we've been around for 15 years almost. And we went out and got investors. We raised $30 million and we built a proprietary uh, software system for branding and marketing. Um, so we have clients, you know, we lots and lots of big global clients like Wendy's and Comerica Bank and uh, Chevron, companies like that. So we have tens of thousands of users that are on our platform. Now our platform, the way it was built, because we've had lots of different development teams, um, we've touched about everything. There's CSS, uh, C++, JavaScript, PHP, I mean, you name it. And it's, we've even got Drupal wrapped in there. So uh, when the alpha came out, we got our team together and I said, I want you to look at this because this is something I've been wanting to do for a long time with our company and our team has, is to go out and take uh, the entire platform and rewrite it. So we're talking about an enterprise level application of Wix code now. So we're gonna, I think we're going to be the biggest test coming out of the gate for you guys. For, Cheers to that. Yeah. Cheers to that. Yeah. That is that is amazing. We I cannot yeah. wait to see this. Yeah, what's amazing, we sat upstairs just a while ago and watched Avi Shai, the CEO, and a bunch of other people put on a demonstration. It was amazing. Because um, I'm not a coder, I'm a designer. And the other pros here have said the same thing. Um, what really struck me and was true was the interface. Um, it is easy. It's built in there. And yeah. you watch some tutorials, all of a sudden you can do this stuff. And what's really cool is for people that are used to our API now or, or what we use in the editor now, when you click on like a picture and you see the little icons that come on up like change picture and all the other things on there, code's just another one on there. Yeah. It's just, it's, it's on there. And then they've actually optimized some of those other icons that are there. If you do choose code, it changes some of the functionality of those. So I, this is so thought through, it's not even funny. It's, I was blown away up there watching it, and I felt more confident than ever that we're going to be able to pull this off. That's that's really that that, that makes me feel good because because I know there's 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 so many creative geniuses in our community. I've seen some of the work, and I'm just blown away. What yeah. what do you say to those out there in our community that 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 may not be at all be interested in coding? Right. What what you know you you've you hire a lot of the experts from this yeah. group mm -hmm. and, and, and sort of use them to, to grow your clients and, and, and sort of like a, a mini arena in some yeah. sense. Yeah, it is. How, how, what, what do you have planned for this, for, for our community? Um, I, I don't want anybody to fear it. I want you to embrace it. Um, I think that ModSocket, because of our alliance with FedEx Office, we're, they're now putting us in all of their offices and they're starting with Texas and California. They've got 7 million customers, so we're going to experience some rapid growth. And I think that as independents like you guys are building your companies, I think you can now charge more because this is going to allow you, even if you're not a coder, to do an, enough element of coding that you're going to be able to charge more money for your websites. Uh, and we're not going to see these things where I can only get $250, $400, or $500. You know, you're going to be putting some zeros behind that. And it's just perception reality stuff. They don't know how, need to have how easy it is. They don't need to know that before writing code might have taken six months to do what you can do probably in three days with this thing. We had, we had a demo upstairs. Where they, they showed us something they built in 48 hours that was ridiculously complex. And me knowing what it would have taken my coders to build it, that, that was three months condensed down to 48 hours. And so... I, I think as a, as a company, we're also going to come out and we're going to try to, within the community, help all of you embrace this by putting uh, a site up and, and where we can all help each other with code, buy code snips, have forums. We want to create a community within the Wix community under the tutelage of Brett and his group um, that's an extension of where we are today with the arena. And we want to be everybody from the beginners that are coming in to the to the really uh, uh, experts that are out there to do, to do nothing but code. So. so it's sort of like, it's sort of like taking the community, using the community to create code for the community. Correct. We, I think we just all keep it within ourselves and, I, and we can just help ourselves blow this thing out. Well, that's a very interesting thing because if some people, you know, there are going to be some projects that I think will require a lot. And I think there's going to be some things that require a little. And, yeah. you know, we talked about, you've all talked about some stuff that he's seen that's amazing that requires no code. 
Yeah. And I've seen some stuff that they'll they'll blow your mind up there. It's it's crazy what they can do. So and, and you were mentioning the the snips being able to be able yeah. to find a marketplace now where you could come in and say, um, I need an API that's going to link me into Constant Contact doing this, and it'll be out there, mm -hmm. and you're going to know where to find it. So I think for all of us to help each other on this, this is how this thing's going to grow. And I can tell you, have having seen and spoken and heard with those guys upstairs, the manager of this company said, they're counting on us to be the disciples for this thing. This is going to grow because of this group. And um, I've never seen such dedication from a company to open their arms to basically strangers to come in and just help them grow their product and make it great. So, I mean, I'm excited to be a part of that. I agree, but I don't feel like strangers. I know all of y'all. Oh, yeah. it's, it's, it's amazing. It's, and by it's, the way, he's exactly like this when the camera's not on. <laughs> you have to peel him off the ceiling all the time. So, <laughs> so it's, 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 it's amazing, though, and I, I, I love the fact that you're, that you're doing that with the community for the community. Yeah, there's more to come, and I'm going to be reaching out to a bunch of people in the community. Let's, I've already reached out to some, but there's going to be more involved. I think that's amazing. Everybody, that's David Farmer. Thank you thank so you. much. It's, all right. Thank you. Now, last up. Last up. All right. So we still got a couple things we're going to talk about. We want to know how do we play with this. All right. Come on, Miss Marlowe. <laughs> Some of you may know her. Cheers. Cheers, Miss Marlowe. Cheers. If y'all do not know Marlowe, for those of you who are in Alpha, you now have a face. Oh, sorry. Oh, it's not bad luck. Like, no, no, no. I was, cheers, no, I'm, I'm doing this like I normally do. No, okay. Most of you, 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 you've interacted with her. If you are in the Alpha, this is now the face. Huh? First of all, I am going to say thank you on behalf of the community to you. Well, thank you to the community for providing us with so much in inspiration and information about what you do. I know I get to talk about that a little bit more. Um, it's been such a pleasure to meet with all of you here in this room and so many of you out there to um, hear about the types of sites that you're building, who your clients are, how much you love Wix. And we want to do everything we can to keep you on this platform all the time because we know you don't like it when a client says, no, I, want, I need to... Build that on, you know, WordPress or some other platform, and and you know, part of the inspiration behind this product was making sure that you can really build anything for any type of client on Wix. Just so y'all know, this is your champion. She has met with so many of y'all, and she has taken all of that that data and sitting down and listening to what you say. Tell us a little bit about how their input has directly shaped this. Absolutely. And it's it's not even just the in-person conversations. It's been, you know, over the, the course of the, the few years that I've been at Wix, we have been looking at the tickets that you submit, your feature requests. We've even listened to um, your calls into the, the call center for support. We want to know what you need to get the job done. So on many levels over the course of, I don't know, the past couple of years, we've been just gathering a lot of data about who you are and making sure that you know, we can we can really deliver what you need. And, you know, as a part of the conversations and knowing all of these things, we, we do know that a lot of you don't know code or that you want to learn code. So when we put together our resources, we wanted to make sure that we, we were bringing together everything that could help you learn in the best possible way. So we have a very extensive documentation set to help you get off the ground, almost like 125 articles in editor help. We have videos, video tutorials, tons of examples that show you really cool features and gets you really inspired with interactions and, and a lot of things you can do as you want to like dip your toes into the coding world. We make that a lot easier for you. So we, we know we understand your strengths. We, we, we know about um, how much you love Wix and, and how just how much fun you have building with Wix. And we wanted to make this product fun for you and keep this to be truly a Wix experience. Yeah. Make it easy to use, make it, you know, have all that drag and drop fun that you love, but then also add a lot of you know, advanced functionality and really make it data driven. That's amazing. And it's, it's, <clears throat> it's such an undertaking to constantly do exactly the things you're talking about. And, and you said it in one sentence, but when you say all of the data and all the stuff, that's a big deal. Yeah. We, we listen and, yeah. and, and you listen and you have gone out there and this has been directly shaped by their feedback. Again, another example of what our expert community really represents yes. to us. Yeah. It's not just it's not just about baking cakes, y'all. No. Although that's fun. And I will say even the, when you talk on Facebook Live, like I mean in, in your Facebook group, we're checking in on the Facebook group to see the kinds of things that that are causing you problems, that are making things difficult for you or what you like, what you don't. So anyhow, um it's just we're paying attention, we're always listening. So let's talk about getting you into the beta though. That's, that's what we're here to talk about. I I I, I... 
When, when can they apply? You can apply now. Oh! Please do. Please apply right now. Beta is open, I don't know if we can put this on the screen, but it's basically www.wix.com slash code slash home, and you can apply. I'll add it. Ad. I'll add it after. And also, the other thing I want to add is I want to add all the websites that everybody was right. talking about so you can see what other experts that you just heard from, what they're working on. And if you want to check it out before applying, we list the, the, the primary features. We list um, all of our resources. We have an FAQ section if you want to know more. Um, there's just tons of information on the site. It's beautiful. There's animations. That's it's just it's so inspiring, and it was built with Wix code. That's the coolest oh. part. This was a Wix built site on Wix code, and so um, I think that you'll see it, and you'll just be so inspired. Sign up for the beta, and um, then you're just gonna have a lot of fun once you get in there. We're I, I'm excited. I, I I'm, I'm I'm I think I'm so excited to 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 see our community explode and grow. And I want to see what you're working on, Anthony, and I want to see what everybody's going to do. I want to see what you can do with this because because it's it's obvious that you guys have this amazing design flair. I've seen stuff from all of y'all, and it's just ridiculous. But now add this to it, and I can't wait to see what y'all do next. And when you join the beta, I will say this. That um, one of the things that we're we're doing during the beta process is collecting feedback from you, and there's even a place for you to show off your work. And we get oh, so yes. inspired by the work that that you guys are actually building right now. We've what we've seen in the alpha, what we're going to see in the beta moving forward. Um, all of the information we collect from you, but your feedback, the questions you have, the way you're able to answer other users' questions as you become more familiar with the system, um, all of that's going to help us figure out the right features to bring to you next and to uh, continue our roadmap for you, and also just so we can check out all the things you're creating because we can't imagine all of the types of sites that you guys build. Oh, yeah. And we talk to you, and it's it's crazy stuff, and it's so cool, and uh, we love very it. You're exciting. always inspiring us. It's very exciting. Does anybody have any questions? Matt, I'm, I'm jumping to you. Have you seen any questions that have jumped through here that anybody wants to ask Marlo? Or? A couple of people have asked if you're already in the alpha or you're also in the beta. Oh, it, absolutely. It, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Rolls it's, over. It's, yeah. <laughs> Turn you off. <laughs> yeah, you any, have to reapply. That's all any other questions? Back. That's it. Right. Is there any any other questions? I'm gonna leave it for for ten seconds. Anybody? Yeah. Marla, this is this is. I'm so excited to finally to 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 be able to say Wix code, y'all. <laughs> How amazing is that? We can finally say it. So so now, if you get in the alpha, if you're if you're already in the alpha and you have a site, drop it after this yeah. video. We need to see it. I want to see it. I'm excited. Anybody that joins the beta now, that's open for everyone, make something, do something, show us. We want to see. This is, this is, blow our minds. I'm so excited to see what this community can do. So, any other questions? One final toast. Yeah, Everybody, come it. around. Come around. <laughs> Wix code, y'all. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Wow. Cheers. Thanks again, y'all. This has been amazing. Y'all go enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you so much. Sign up for the beta. Sign up for the beta. Bye. Are you off? No, I'm waiting. I think. Somebody, they were asking questions. It was just import export. Was oh, okay. I'll talk to her later. Oh, oh, oh. I know. I I know you know Sissy pretty well. So. How many Wix code y'alls did they say? A bunch. Oh, the people loving Marlo. Look, I love Marlo. Yeah. What? Yeah. Somebody said I love Marlo. Oh, that's. You're nice. called Wix Marlo Wonder Mar Woman as well. Wix Wonder Woman. Wix Wonder Woman. Oh, that's amazing. That's what I'd have known that. If I'd have, you'd have said that. I'd have. Going ham bone with it. Like, Y'all, that was amazing. That was amazing. Good job. Good job. Let's go. Let Julie now you Gabby, when did y'all get Did y'all at least join in for the toast? No. I did a little bit, but I didn't have a cup. No worries. <laughs> I just I saw you live, I just gave the